Hello everybody, it's Tidy One here in today's video. We're going to talk about, um, I haven't done it in a while, we're going to talk about some Assassin's Creed stuff. Um, what I want to talk about today is, um, <clears throat> I've actually completed most of every single one of those games. I pretty much own all of them. Um, pretty much the whole franchise from the first to all the way from, uh, Valhalla. The one I don't have is like Liberation and the, the Chronicle ones. Those are the ones I don't really have. Um, but anyways, I actually have beaten most of those. And, um, every single one of those, actually. Um, including the Assassin's Creed uh, four, 4 Black Flags, the uh, Freedom Cry uh, uh, sequel uh, concept to that game. Um, I even beat that as well. Um, I think one of the things I like about the Assassin's Creed franchise is, you know, the whole climbing stealth, the whole climbing stealth type, type thing, and then, you know, climbing up and synchronizing and stuff, so you have the viewpoint all around and visualizing everything around you and stuff, it's kind of fun, <coughs> and kind of a cool way in, of everything that's around you and stuff and I think it's kind of cool little show there um the other thing I was uh, I'm gonna add here is um I like the whole exploring with most of these games like yeah you can complete your missions and stuff like that and fight fight off bad guys basically fight off Templars and stuff just like Running, they're running around and stuff within the games. Um, I like is I like the exploring of it and stuff. So it's like there's lots of pretty cool things about it, and you just explore, free roam type of thing. And I think that's what's kind of fun about those types of open world games and stuff like that. Just to kind of do your thing and explore, but can't forget about doing some of your missions because there are some checkpoints that aren't going to let you go too far and if you don't like do them they kind of they're like yeah um and stuff but you know you're kind of but no but now with the new assassin's creed you know they do they're doing the stuff like rpg like styles and stuff. so for instance origins odyssey and Valhalla. You know, some parts, you kind of have to level up in order to go to those spots. Because if you go to those spots when you're not leveled up when you should be, oh man, you're going to have a hard time getting... <laughs> yeah, you're going to have a hard time kind of getting out of there. Because, uh... It's not fun. And plus, I kind of like, you know, those types of games. I think they're super fun. And plus, um... Have pretty cool features for those. Um, one of the things I'm, I would like to see for Assassin's Creed is like I would like I would like to see more exploring with those games. Um, there's obviously a lot of different history, and yes, there are some there are some historical things they don't really want, like World War II, which I think Call of Duty should do those and kind of as if because. The whole point of uh, Assassin's Creed, you know, one of the things is like the viewpoint and the type deal and the stealth of it. Because to me, when you go into that stealthy, in that World War II, there's not very many places you could hide in plain sight, especially when you got people that have guns and some of them have like Tommy automatic like machine guns during those times. So, um,. And obviously, you're not going to be running around dressed in white. You'd be seen, like no, no doubt. Um, but you know, it's kind of interesting to me as like how the, how they would do that type of concept. And since it's, since Assassin's Creed is kind of a melee, you know, like deal, you know, it's kind of getting to that deal where like how are they going to do that? So, um, excuse me. Anyways, um. I think a couple cool concepts I'd like to see for Assassin's Creed. I'd like to see them explore, 
you know, some of these Asian, like, countries and stuff, I think those would be kind of fun. So, like, China, Japan, uh, Mongolia would be a pretty nice concept, too. Um, I think those places would be pretty interesting to explore. Um, uh, Mexico, I think, would be kind of a cool little concept to explore. Kind of explore, you know, like, the Aztec, like, deals. I think that'd be kind of a nice little deal. Um, another one I think would be kind of fun to do. I think um, if you did some stuff with like uh, the Roman Empire days, um, of course, so there what we there wasn't quite like it, but you, but you probably could do a similar concept from it. You know, the, the there was a kind of a Roman Empire like game which was called uh, Son of Rome, which. Um, I actually have that game. Actually, that game's not actually too bad either. Uh, I remember when that game first came first came out with the Xbox One was like first introduced. Um, you can get pretty much that game now. You can get that for like five bucks now. Um, depending on the stores though. Um, you could do a similar concept with that and do like some stuff with like Roman Empire and stuff. I think that'd be kind of. Um, kind of a cool concept um I think another one would be kind of cool of course a lot of people are kind of skeptical about it which I understand um since you're kind of getting into since you kind of showed some stuff with it I think a wild west one would be kind of an interesting concept too um Yes, of course, a lot of people that are kind of like, how's the guns going to work? And, I mean, you've had some guns kind of work in um, Syndicate and um, uh, that was Creed 4 Black Flags. Even though those were like muskets and everything, I mean, you kind of got into that. But still, you know, when it comes to well, less type stuff. I mean, there's con there's deals where you could like you know, um, there's some there's some pretty interesting stuff you could do with you know the Wild West type days and stuff. I know there is. I mean, it'd be an interesting little deal though. Um, another thing that another another Assassin's Creed concept that I think would be kind of nice to, try, to explore is you did it with Revolutionary War. I think it'd be kind of cool if it did one with, like, the Civil War. Now, there's a lot of interesting, cool things you can do with it. Of course, though, I know a lot of people, you got to be careful with certain concepts, like, you know, all that type of thing, and offensive things, and whatnot. Um, but I think it'd be kind of a cool concept to explore, because there's a lot of things, you know, that went on during that Civil War time. And... I think it'd be interesting to kind of, you know, explore that. And I think it'd be kind of cool if you had a concept with, you know, like Harriet Tubman and, and that type of concept. And I thought that'd be kind of a cool, kind of a con deal, deal to explore and everything. Um, but, um, yeah. Um, I think my next concept I'd like for them to try out would be... I like to see them do, you know, like a 1920s type Assassin's Creed. I mean, it, it would kind of have a similar tone to, like, the Syndicate. But in the Assassin's Creed, um, well, 1920s, during that time, there was a lot of gangster mobs and all that type of stuff. So obviously there would be some interesting stuff you could explore there. And there are some pretty interesting, you know, weapons that they did use back in those times. I mean, yes, they had, you know, the 1911 Colt. They had the six-shooter, you know, like, six-shooter, like, guns and stuff like that. Um, the Tommy gun. They had the shotguns. Um, not sure what other guns they had. Um... 
I'm not sure what kind of knives they have, but I know they had some kind of knives. Brass knuckles would be one. Uh, baseball bat so it was kind of a concept in there, too. Um, I would say a Kirk, a Kirk, a Kirkry, which is that little kind of like curved like blade is kind of in that concept too which we've kind of had that from syndicate which i would see it translate to that too um those are kind of that kind of shows up in there too um but yeah i think it'd be kind of cool to swap, do a 1920s deal i mean you can have it explored based you know in parts of like new york um i can see boston kind of being the deal with that too um I don't know. I think it'd be interesting to do, though. Um, it's not Boston. Um, sh old parts of... It's not Boston. Um, Chicago. I think it'd be kind of a cool concept we can do with it, too. So so there's definitely some inter some pretty nice things you can do with that, too. Um, let's see. What else? Could, like a concept for... Um, I think, um, one, I think it'd be kind of interesting, of course, though, I think they're kind of, I think they're one to kind of do the, one of those at some point, uh, Assassin's Creed, um, exploring the parts of, uh, India, I think would be, would be kind of cool, um, India is kind of one of those places, you know, that, um, you can explore, and I think it'd be kind of interesting to do. Especially for, you know, that type of type of concept, and uh, I can see the little disc deal and stuff. I can see that being a concept, and those would be like a little like throwing like weapon and stuff. Because uh, um, I think it'd be kind of kind of cool to have that and kind of throw that around and stuff. Um, yeah, there's a lot of cool things you definitely do with that. Um, let's see, what else? I'm trying to think of some other concepts for Assassin's Creed. Um, other places you could explore. Um, I think, um, I'm trying to think of one spot that's, they haven't even used, I'm trying to think of a spot they haven't even used yet, um, That Egyptian one was pretty cool, um, and then of course Odyssey was kind of in Greece, so there was some exploring in that. So on parts of Greece, so there's that. Um, I'm trying to think. You kind of had already an Italy concept from Assassin's Creed 2 and 3 so from Assassin's Creed 2 and Brotherhood was was kind of exploring the Italy parts so you already had that um I think I think one last a spot I like to see them explore I think it would be kind of cool if they did um Kind of a concept with um, damn it, I can't think. <laughs> um, dang 
point. What's another country? I've already explored London, England. Um, I was thinking maybe a part in Spain or something, or maybe a part in Spain or somewhere. Um, I think maybe a, maybe a spot in like Spain or something would be kind of a cool little concept, or Brazil. I'm sure there's some deals that you can do with those. Um, New Zealand, probably. Um, but um, I guess we'll just see what the franchise holds for us right now, because I'm sure there's lots of ideas that I can think of that you know are going to be interesting spots and things so okay guys that's going to be it for today's video post a comment section below if you like this video hit the like button and if you're new to the channel don't forget to hit this red button as always i will see you all in the next video goodbye